You scared me! <laughs> Don't do that, Muse. Sorry, I was zoning out. Is break time over already? Oh no, you can relax a little while longer. But I'm surprised you know about it too. That tranquil place. Sad, yet beautiful. Huh? worry. You'll definitely get a chance to visit. You and that red-haired bracer can go pay your respects together. <gasps> Muse, what does she... <laughs> Looks like they beat me to it. 
wonder if that kid's the one I've been hearing so much about. Guess we'll just have to see what he's made of, and how much our little one's grown while we're at it. <laughs> no objections here. Let's go. You guys... We just heard from Instructor Toa. Is it true? Did you really get orders from the Imperial government? Are you really going to be heading off without us? Well... That would explain Major Arendelle's presence here. So it's true then? <sighs> it's true. Our special ops missions are done for now. Work on your exercises with Class 8 and Class 9. Understood. Then I shall join. No exceptions. That includes you, Altina. What? But I need to provide support. Regardless of your other circumstances, you're still a student of the branch campus. I can't allow my students to get dragged into my personal business. Major Lecter understands this too. I think this is a good opportunity for you. Stay with Yuna and Kurt. But I... <sighs> Allow me to ask one thing. Hmm? What is it? It looks like you've accepted help from a member of the Arsade School. Is the Vander School... Am I not enough? <laughs> That's right. You're not. The fact that you're one of my students aside, it doesn't matter how much talent you have or that you've managed to reach intermediate level at your age. I can't take someone who lacks confidence and conviction to such a dangerous place. <laughs> Excuse me. when I was starting to change my mind about you.
<laughs> you leaving already? Must be tough having to spend your whole morning running around the Empire. Well, that's a government job for you. So, how's everything going on your end? <laughs> I can't say nothing yet. But... Seems like a lot of stuff's starting to overlap. I see. Man, I sure am glad I recommended you here. Well, here's hoping you find a juicy clue or two before your field exercises are over. <laughs> Keep walking, straw man. Like several threads have become entangled. Also, the little game being played here in Sutherland has reached its second half. But what if I nudge things along a little? What's up, Breen? Been a while. <laughs> yeah. Guess the last time was our little scouting session right before your graduation. Good to see you, too. Sounds like you've got your hands full with the teaching gig, huh? Nah, ain't no biggie. Besides, we got Fee last year, and she's more than enough of a catch. But hey, you ever change your mind, door's always open.
All right, let's go. Yeah! Yeah! Easy now. Easy now. Yeah! Easy. Yeah! Yeah! I passed by here with the students just yesterday. Easy uh -huh. now. You worried about them, Reen? Now, bring it on! Marcus, activate me. My turn. Uh, let's go. Uh, let's go. Arcus, activate. Battle complete. Let's move. Yeah! Let's do our best. Sit! Let's go! <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Whew, threat eliminated. Sheesh. Yeah! This one's strong! Be careful! Ready? Huh? Ha! You're done. I'll handle this. No escape. See ya! Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Arcus, activate. Huh? Oh, we did it somehow. All right, got it.
All right, let's go. Yeah! Easy now. Easy now. Yeah! Yeah! Everyone, be careful! Arcus, activate! My turn! I'm up! Arcus, activate! Now! Let's go! Huh. My turn! Duh. Is that all? You must train more. Yeah! All right, let's go. Should be the leftmost path at this junction. Roger that. Let's go. I won't go easy. It's down. Keep it up. This will end it. I'll handle this. Sick. Let's go. Sick. It's down. An opening. Just what I expect from you, Laura. I believe that's my line. Yeah! You there, what business do you have here? Whoa, Reen? What are you doing here?
Oh, wow. You're all from Class 7. <laughs> Long time no see. Do you remember me? Warrant Officer Allen of the Imperial Army's 4th Armored Division. <laughs> Been a while, everyone. Seeing you all together, it's like I've gone back to Thor's. Hmm. Actually, I take that back. You've grown into fine young men and women. It makes me proud to be able to say I was one of your instructors. Thank you, sir. <laughs> yeah, thank you. The general is waiting. I'll guide you from here. Good work, soldier. Sir! General, they have arrived. Come in. He always strikes me as such an authoritative man in person. Me too. And I'm sure he's become more so since his promotion. My baby bundle of joy! Oh, Elliot! All right, no need for that. We'd like to cut right to the chase. If that's okay. <clears throat> You've become a true man, son. Does a father's heart good to see? Every time, like clockwork. Yeah, but Elliot's really perfected dodging it. <clears throat> In any event, it may be unwise to have you here given our positions, but I nonetheless welcome you. <laughs> Do you mean... It seems you're already aware why we've come. Of course. The primary duty of this fortress is to maintain order in the southern half of the Empire. I suspect I'll be unable to help. But please, spare no detail.
Hey, time for lunch yet? Uh, uh, Agate? Wow, Agate! Is it really you? I look like I'm anyone else? I've been a few weeks now. You gotten settled in here? <laughs> yes, everyone here is so nice. But what are you doing here? Oh, yeah. Just stop by to see how you were doing and take care of an errand. Seems like yesterday got pretty crazy. Sorry for not being here to help. Oh, Agate. <laughs> Don't worry. You're always with me. Right here. For crying out loud. Here you go, Kurt. The other one's for you, Allie. Ah, thank you. Thanks. Um, out of curiosity, what is an Allie? Hmm? Oh, <laughs> I just shortened your name a little. It's easier if I call you that. You like it? Huh. <sighs> You've started acting like her too now. Well, I don't care. Call me whatever you like. <laughs> Really? Ali it is then. While we're at it, how about you, Kurt? Huh? Where are you going? Wait, you're not... Don't worry, I'm just going to train. Though I may lack skill and resolve, I'm still not foolish enough to go out on my own. Hey. Just because he said that doesn't mean... I'm fine. I know he did it to keep us out of danger. It's too much for us. No, for me, to handle. What he said wasn't wrong. Kurt... <laughs> I still feel pathetic, though. But this is simply because I'm not good enough as I am now. All I can do is accept it and let it fuel me for next time. Provided there is a next time. <sighs> Boys are so bad at this sort of thing. Huh? Listen, Kurt. I get that you want to sound all tough and grown up and talk about how you accept the way things are. But the look on your face is telling me a different story. <clears throat> What's wrong with just saying, I'm frustrated I got left behind? No one should be okay with being tossed aside like that. Me and Ali feel the same way. I do not know if I would call it frustrating, but generally speaking, I share the opinion. I've supported Instructor Reen in his missions over the past year. Though I am technically a student now, I remain unconvinced it was a good reason for excluding me. I see. So that was what was going on between you two? <sighs> that heartless jerk! How dare he do that to a cute little girl like you? I know all that. I do. Kurt, the only one who can decide your path as a member of the Vander family is you. Perhaps enrolling at the branch campus will help you find your way. But even so, what am I supposed to do? Nothing will change the fact that I was left behind for being too immature. Kurt... Well, you won't know until you take action, right? If there's something you aren't happy with, then do something about it. Even if it seems impossible, you just need to struggle and struggle and keep struggling until you overcome it. That's what all the people I respect and admire do. Huh? You know what? Being told I'm a burden by someone who's only known me a month kind of pisses me off. Let's show him just how wrong he was about us. The two of us are with you. Right, Allie? I have no reason to object. 
My current mission is to support Class 7. You certainly are optimistic. Or, at the very least, refreshingly blunt. Judging by the way you were talking, I assume you have a plan, yes? We'll need to figure out a way to catch up to Instructor Reen, and how we can help after that. Huh? Uh, d do I have a plan? Uh, well, uh, I kinda do, and I kinda don't? Was all of that said without a plan? I'm quite impressed, actually. Ch shut up! We just need to come up with something together. <laughs> You're right. It won't be easy, though. <laughs> I'm so glad the three of you seem to be feeling better. You're from Class 9, right? Muse, was it? Is there something we can help you with? Oh, quite the opposite. You see, I happen to overhear a little something. And I thought the three of you might be interested in it. Huh? That's... What exactly are you talking about? <laughs> I'd bet good Mira it's something fun. I want in. You? Ash, what are you doing here? <laughs> well then. Since we're all here now, let's have ourselves a little chat, shall we? I was looking at a map of the area when I happened to notice a certain spot. <laughs> 